We sort of had our sights set on a fab lab. So a fab lab is a space that sort of exists all around the world. They're spaces that communities can use and come together to basically make, make projects and usually make projects that are digitally based. And we're also looking at a way to bring together different areas of the TAFE. So rather than have a space like this attached to one department, we wanted a space that could be central that all different departments could come and use. So internal teachers came and learned how to use this space and use the equipment. A lot of community people have come in and a lot of industry people have come in. So we've had all the local high schools in Wengrata and Benalla uh, participate in a six week program. So they've come over here and done um, different jobs, they've made different t-shirts, they've made jigsaws on the laser cutter, they've 3D printed cars, they've used a vacuum former. They've used a whole range of equipment on projects of their choosing. Nobody comes in here and is told this is what you'll do. They usually come in here with an idea and we help them nurture that idea and come up with a product at the end. We, we saw that need for a space like this, not only in Australia, but in, in Victoria and regional Victoria. We're probably the first regional space like this. So a lot of people in the future, we believe, will need to work for themselves. So. They, you know, if they have an idea, we can help them develop their idea, engineer their, their idea, make their idea, give them some marketing skills to help sell their product, give them some um, internet skills uh, so they can actually create their own web page and sell stuff off the web. So it, it's becoming, a, we're trying to make it like a little um, incubator to, um, for startups. We're more into um, prototyping and one-offs and we can help someone fine tune a design and then they can either go out and outsource to get it made or they can look at buying the equipment to make it themselves. Still space, so we've, we're running a digital fabrication course, so there'll be a lot of 3D design in there. We'll learn to 3D draw to start, then design, and then once you basically can draw something in 3D space, we have most of the equipment in here that you can then build it. So it's really about that getting something out of your head onto a computer in 3D world and then producing the part. It doesn't matter what medium you're tr or what subject you're training in, when you can see that that like spark that, that, that a student gets or that, that enjoyment that they get out of something or you can see that, that that's great, as a teacher that's, that's why you do it. As soon as I get them walking in the door here, I can then show them, but I can show them the stuff running. I can get them on a 3D printer within half an hour. I can get them on that laser cutter in five minutes and they see something, they, they produce a part in, you know, 30 seconds and go, wow, so okay, well imagine that fitting into, you know, what, ask them what sort of stuff do you enjoy? Oh, I'm really into cars, let's say. Well, you know, we could, you know, in a car, could you see this little fitting in your car? Oh yeah, I could make a badge, I could do this. And I'm like, yeah, okay, well imagine if you did that and then imagine if you put that into this part and then put it into a bit of timber routing. So it's just getting someone in the door and then you can have the conversation with them. And most of the time, they will they'll go, oh yeah, I can see an application. And if they can see an application, then I'll say, well, look, if you don't want to commit to enrolling in a long, you know, say 12 month course, come and do a night with us or come and do four nights with us and just have a bit of a, a tinker around and see the basics of the machine and then make a decision and see if you want to come and enroll in a longer course. We're open to anyone to come and have a look and then spread the word and, and hopefully we can get more and more people into this space and, you know, really get it um, cranking.